channel. I don't know if you can tell, but it is currently October and it is almost Halloween. So guess what I'm gonna be doing today? Yes, you'll probably guess right. I am going to decorate some pumpkins. Every year I always carve a pumpkin, but I've never actually painted them and used glitter. So I thought I would do a little video for you today to show you a couple of things you can do with pumpkins. So first up, I'm going to take this tiny little pumpkin, which is definitely my favourite. I'm also going to take a can of gold spray paint and I'm going to go into my garage to do this one. So welcome to my garage. What I'm going to do first is spray paint this pumpkin gold. And then I'm just going to leave it to dry and then when it's dry I'll flip it over and spray paint the underneath. My little gold pumpkin has almost dried so now I'm just going to use some black paint to finish the top. and I'm going to take some white paint which I brought from Tesco and I'm going to take a paintbrush and cover the whole of the pumpkin. And after you've done one layer on the whole pumpkin, let it dry and then repeat the process. So my pumpkin has had two layers and is pretty much dry so now I'm going to use my black paint to paint a scary face on my pumpkin. And the last thing I'm going to do is just paint the top of the pumpkin. So next for this little pumpkin, you're going to need some masking tape and some scissors. And we're going to put four strips of masking tape either side of our pumpkin. So just start at the top and then work your way to the bottom. And now we're gonna head to the garage and spray paint these orange sections. pumpkin is starting to dry I'm going to slowly take off the masking tape and it doesn't really matter if some of the paint has got on the rest of the pumpkin so now your pumpkin should look a little bit like this and I'm going to take it back in the kitchen to finish off the next thing that I'm going to do now is take my black paint and paint over the orange you've done one side leave it to dry and then paint another coat for my last and final pumpkin I'm going to do as I did before and take my masking tape and block off four different sections And 
that and it's pressed down securely. I'm going to cover the four visible sections in glue and then I'm going to get messy and cover them in glitter. leave it to dry for 20 minutes to half an hour. So once the glitter has dried on our pumpkin, it's time to take off the masking tape. And finally, to finish this pumpkin, I'm going to be painting the orange with my black paint. 